Once upon a time in a vibrant village in West Africa, there lived a humble farmer and his wife, who longed for a child. Their lives were simple, but their hearts were full of dreams and hopes. One day, the wife fell ill and yearned for the leaves of a special tree called the Mbongo tree, known for its healing powers. This tree belonged to a powerful sorceress named Mama Nango, who lived in the heart of the sacred forest. Desperate to save his wife, the farmer sneaked into the forest and stole some leaves from the Mbongo tree. Mama Nango caught him and, in her fury, declared that the price for his theft would be their firstborn child. A year later, a beautiful baby girl was born to the farmer and his wife. They named her Zahara, which means flower in Swahili. True to her word, Mama Nango came to claim the child and took Zahara deep into the forest. Mama Nango raised Zahara in a tall, isolated baobab tree, hidden from the world. Zahara's hair, imbued with the magic of the Mbongo tree, grew longer and stronger each day. One day, a young prince named Kofi, while hunting in the forest, heard a melodious song. He followed the voice and saw Zahara at the top of the baobab tree. Enchanted, he called out, Zahara, Zahara, let down your hair. Over time, Kofi visited often, bringing stories and gifts. Zahara, both frightened and fascinated, fell deeply in love. Together they planned Zahara's escape. One day, Mama Nango discovered their plan. In her rage, she cut Zahara's hair and banished her to a distant desert. She also cast a spell on the baobab tree, making it impossible for Kofi to climb again. After many days, Kofi found Zahara in the desert. Using the magic from a sacred river, he restored her hair and freed her from Mama Nango's curse. They returned to the village, where they were reunited with her parents and celebrated with a grand feast. Zahara and Kofi married, and the village prospered with the blessings of the Mbongo tree. Their story was passed down through generations, a tale of love, bravery, and the enduring power of hope. And so, they lived happily ever after, under the warm African sun. <laughs>